हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल सो टुडे आई गॉट द डिलीवरी पैकेज ऑफ बीएलडीसी सीलिंग फैन व्हिच आई ऑर्डर जस्ट टू डेज बैक सो टुडे आई गॉट द डिलीवरी पैकेज एंड रियली आई डोंट नो दैट व्हाट इज देयर इनसाइड सो आई हैव टू जस्ट चेक व्हाट इज देयर एंड आई विल जस्ट ओपन दिस पैकेज जस्ट in front of you guys and uh, let us see what is there and how the ceiling fan looks like what are the part what are the parts there inside so we will just check that sorry uh, so here you can see that this is the <coughs> body of the ceiling fan and here the blades are there so there there is i think the receipt paper and this is now useless and we have to check that what is there inside this body and we have to just fix this fix this blades to the body of the ceiling fan so guys you can see this is of crompton crompton is the company and uh, it's a very prestigious reputed company and uh, Uh, this uh, this is the body of the ceiling fan so i will just open it and here is the blades and here you can see is also of the crompton company energy that is energy and uh, let us see what is there inside the body of the ceiling fan here you can see this may be the rod uh, from which it will the fan will be suspended from the ceiling and here is the cap and it's the cover part so this swing uh, what are the parts are there this is an another cap that is the container and here maybe there are some screws which will be needed for fixing the fan and here is the remote from which the fan will be controlled here is the body 
so i'm telling you it's very very heavy and be careful while you are handling this body and it's a electronic circuit okay the electronic circuit that means uh, it will be get operated by 12 volt the 220 volt will be get converted to 12 volt and the 12 volt will operate this fan so it's very very heavy and th these are the points where the blades will be get fixed so here is the body So guys, uh, we have already fixed the blades. Now we have to fix the supporting rod from which the ceiling fan will be suspended from the ceiling. And uh, here you can see there is a screw which is already fixed. And uh, this screw will be get fixed in this upper hole. And remember the, uh, if uh, you can see there is a cut over this hole, this will be fixed. Uh, so this side will be fixed on the lower hand side of the fan. And the upper part of this fan will be get fixed to the ceiling. Okay. So remember this, uh, this cut will be on the lower side of the fan. And now we have to fix this, this, you, you can call that it is the main screw, okay. And uh, this main screw will be get fixed on this upper hole and there will be another a supporting screw and which will be there in the box and it will be get fixed on the, on this lower hole, okay. So let's see how we can fix that. So just open it. And just, yeah. So we have fixed this and we have to just tie this screw another time with a screwdriver. So guys, now we have to just fix this, fix this supporting screw and uh, let's see how we can do it. We have to just open these bolts and just fix, just simply fi uh, fix this nut and just from the other hand side, just fix the bolts, okay. So here you can see that. So we have to just make this rod tight. Okay. And this another thing. So we have fixed it and now we have to just fix those two containers that means the cover and after that we have to just fix these uh, bolts nut bolts for fixing the ceiling okay so we have to fix this rubber so let's see how we can do that so guys before uh, fixing the container uh, we have to just fix the live and neutral wire uh, to these points these two points you can see this is the live wire and this is the neutral wire so how we can fix that we have to just insert two wires from this hole okay and there, there is an, another hole from uh, this side you can see we have to just make those two wires out from here from here you can also uh, take it out and or or you can just uh, make this wire out from this hole this big hole okay so as you wish we have to just fix this ceiling fan okay as per your convenience you can fix that okay so first we have to just insert two wires okay so here I'm just inserting these two wires. Okay. Here you can see I have inserted these two wires from this hole and 
and have taken out these two wires from this big hole okay as per my convenience so then you have to just uh, fix these two points one in the uh, live and one in the neutral okay so let us see how we can do it so guys uh, we have to just fix these two wires one in the neutral hole and one in the live hole okay so let's just try to fix that so i've already entered this inserted this wire okay in this hole so just fix it right okay so another hole uh, is for the live wire just fix that yeah so i think uh, it got fixed on these two holes and now we can comfortably uh, uh, just fix the, on the two containers one at the bottom and one in the upper part okay now we have to just fix this container okay just like this in this way you can fix the container okay and the container must be slightly above the body of this fan otherwise it can create friction okay and it can reduce the speed so it uh, the container must be slightly above the body of this fan okay it shouldn't touch the body of the fan so in this way we have fixed the container now after that we have to just fix this uh, nut bolt for fixing in the ceiling of the uh, for fixing the fan in the ceiling okay so we have to just fix that let's see how we can do that so uh, we have to again fix this container okay this container must be fixed on this upper part of this uh, rod and this is this acts like a cover okay to cover the metal plate which will be used for fixing the uh, ceiling uh, fan and here is the way to just fix just insert the two holes from the uh, from the bottom of this uh, container and just fix it just like this and again i'm telling the same thing make sure the downside container must not touch with the a body of this fan otherwise it can cause friction or it can cause uh, sound unwanted sound okay however uh, these two wires uh, there uh, you have to just again pass these uh, two wires from this hole okay as per your convenience this metal plate okay and just fix this metal plate with the nut bolts which is there but make sure that this hole must coincide with the bottom of this hole okay so the, let's let's just fix that Yeah, so you can see we have already fixed. Now we have to just give those uh, nuts and bolts which are which are there. Just pass just like this. Here you can see. So after that you have to just put these washers, nuts uh, and bolts. Okay, these are some washers. first the big bolts the big bolt which is there okay and then the thin thin one which is there we have to fix that okay so just fix like that this okay and this thin part we have to again fix for uh, extra supporting Okay, just like this you can see so you can use these two plus for keeping the nuts tight okay okay again I'm just making sure that whether it is tightly fixed or not I think it's now it's not safe to hang the ceiling fan okay so this is the way you can fix that and now it's time to hang this uh, in the ceiling okay let's see how it's look like how it looks like okay so guys here you can see I have already installed the fan now it's time to check whether it's it's working or not so I'm giving the switch so here you can see a noise just coming out and our fan is on you can see yeah so previously I have placed one in this remote so that's why 
it's rotating at the speed of 1 and if I just give speed 3 wow it's having a great speed now if I give speed 5 if you always give a uh, command from this remote there will be a red LED blinking at the top of the remote so you can easily understand whether it, it is giving the command or not and in the remote there will be no battery installed previously you have to just install okay uh, any company any type of battery you can install pencil type battery okay so it's working well you can see so I hope uh, this video was quite understandable and stay tuned for next uh, videos, okay? Thank you.